YouTube Final Community, ACDC fans, random people on the internet, my name is Giggins. We're here today to talk about something I sort of recently discovered and recently went down the rabbit hole to try to find more about. Long story short, when I was about 16, 17 years old in the year of 2004, there were rumors about a new ACDC album coming out. And at that time, they had just been inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. They had just released all their albums on CD and vinyl again for the first time. And they played with the Stones. I mean, 2003 was a humongous year for ACDC. And at this time, I was on an ACDC message board before it became this gigantic cesspool of humanity that it eventually became. And I left years before it got as bad as it got. And at the time, this was really early internet. So this was like 2004. I, I think I said March of 2004. Um, searching for, you know, fact-checking, proofreading, sort of existed back then, but a lot of people took things at face value and kind of ran with it. Needless to say, we kind of started a fake album at that time, and it was called Strap It On. Someone else named it, brilliant name for an ACDC album, and basically we came up with a fake track list and we wrote lyrics to the songs that we thought would be on this album. We made up songs and wrote the lyrics to them. I thought I only wrote, wrote one of them. It turns out I wrote several of them, and I printed them off from way back in the day. I printed these off March 6, 2004. I've had this paper for almost 20 years. It's weird to say that. Anyways, at the time, this was being picked up by different music blogs, different other message boards, and a couple actual music websites. I remember Rolling Stone talking about this on their website. For the life of me, I cannot find any trace of that on the internet now. I scoured the Wayback Machine up and down for several days looking for anything to do with this project. The message board I used to post on no longer exists, so that's gone. The Wayback Machine had nothing for it from that time. And so I went onto a modern ACDC message board, and back in 2016, people were talking about this unreleased 2004 album, and they actually found a message board that was some other music related. I think it was a guitar website from 2004 that someone posted the track list. And it mentioned the three songs that I wrote and a bunch of other ones, including Strap It On, which I, I wish I wrote that one. <laughs> and it just brought back so many memories. And the people on this message board were so flabbergasted by the existence of this possible fake ACDC album. So I just wanted to come on here and say, yeah, that album was completely fake. We made it all up. There was no new ACDC album in 2004. They were working in the studio in that time, I think in 2003, but... Yeah, I was a part of the fake ACDC album, and so I wrote three songs. I wrote a song called Down and Dirty, which is a pretty classic ACDC sounding song. I also wrote Break Away, not the Beach Boys song, and the classic drinking anthem, Get in the Buzz. So I thought I'd read these off to you real quick because they're not available anywhere else on the internet. They just don't exist, and that really makes me sad because we got, I remember being so freaked out by it. That's why I printed these off. I printed the lyrics off because at the time I had a pretty crazy anxiety of like thinking I was being watched all the time, which is funny because now I'm on YouTube, but, or ironic, I guess you could say. So I thought I was going to get in major trouble because I was in high school. I was like, oh man, I'm going to get, the cops are going to come after me. I'm going to get arrested. I'm, I'm making up things. I'm going to get sued. It was nuts. It was stupid. I was young. And, I mean, obviously nothing happened, but it did get picked up by these different websites. So it freaked me out. Anyways, also bear in mind, I wrote these songs when I was like 16 or 17 years old. They're awful, but they're meant to be ACDC style lyrics. And I don't know what that says about me as an artist or me as a impersonator, but anyways. So here we go in the past. This is Down and Dirty by... Angus Young, Malcolm Young, Brian Johnson, and Giggins. The way she moves, she's getting me up. She's the only girl I know that will let me fill her cup. What the f As she sweats, I'm placing bets to see if I'm the one who's going to rip off her fishnets. I don't think I've ever even seen fishnets at that point in my life. Chorus. She's down and dirty. She just isn't right. She's down and dirty. And she's mine all night. She's down and dirty. She's down and dirty. Yeah. The bed, it shakes, and so do I. It's just the kind of loving that you're lucky to survive. Actually, that's not a bad line, actually. I bring her down, but she bring me up. 
And when we are all done, baby, I love to watch her strut. That's bloody terrible. Chorus. And then the bridge, I guess. What is this? The way she tastes, never had before. Oh, baby, I feel like a kid in a candy store. She picks up the phone, calls a couple friends. Ha ha, yeah. I hope this night will never end. I'm glad the song ended. The next track, uh, Getting the Buzz. This one's pretty bad. Late night at an open bar and you're looking so fine. That last drink made me dizzy and I think it's time. Time to go. Yeah, time to go. Because I'm getting the buzz. Solo. Because <laughs> that's the price that... That's where a solo goes after the first verse. I switch my seat and get closer to you. The bartender knows what I'm gonna do. I've been here before, he knows my routine. Time to play nice. Yeah, it's time to play nice because I'm getting the buzz. Another solo and then the buzz, the buzz, I'm getting the buzz. The buzz, the buzz, I'm getting the buzz. And the last one, Breakaway. Today it's gonna happen, gonna break away. The rock will start to roll. <laughs> gonna break away. Filling up my Cadillac and hitting the streets today. I'm cruising down the highway, gonna break away. The chorus is break away, busting some balls. Break away, I'll tear down the halls. Break away, I'm 80 stories tall. Break away, break away today. That doesn't rhyme at all. Then it says repeat verse one. The bridge, I'm a tidal wave falling. I'll keep you crawling. I'll break away, baby. I'll break away today. Yeah. Another solo. Then the chorus repeated three times. But every time I would post these, I'd say, <laughs> I, found, I found some more online, guys. Here you go. Guys, I just got a new one. Holy S, I just found the lyrics to Down and Dirty. And there'd be just pages of comments being like, where'd you find this? Where'd you get this? So here they are. Let me get a zoom in here so you can see the date of, eh, where's the camera? 2004, there you go. I haven't printed something in a long time. I'm not sure if printers still put dates on things, but that's how I know this is from, you know, I was in high school at the time, but that's it. Quick little video to say that if you've ever read about the fake ACDC album Strap It On in 2004 and read about the songs Break Away, Down and Dirty, and Getting the Buzz, uh, those three were me. And um, sorry for getting your hopes up, but there you go. Mystery solved. Put the gang back in the Scooby machine. Mystery Machine, get Scooby and the gang, and take off. My name is Giggins. This has been a very fun video to make. Many years in the making. Uh, confessional Times with Giggins. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you ever heard about that fake album back in 2004. Very curious to know what your thoughts are. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.